How's it going guys? So today I'm going to give my first impressions of the new Razer SL one piece sliders. Um, I haven't skated these at all yet. I just got them on, just got them in today. Um, thankfully Oak city is like the fastest shipping around. So as soon as they were up on their website, I got them ordered and had them in within two days. Long is the best just flat out that dude ships so fast i love it um so i'm gonna start off with saying i don't really personally understand the point of changing from a three-piece sole plate to a one-piece slider um other than it, it looks more solid and maybe it'll make the skate feel more solid but i've been skating the old three-piece sole design um one, two, three. And I don't really have any problems out of this. Um, I'm not really sure why other people had problems out of this, but apparently it's what the people want. And so razors made it cool enough for me. So uh, I decided to go ahead and order them and give them a shot. Um, I'll start off by saying um, this one piece slider was very difficult for me to get on. Um, I guess because of how it's molded, the, the slider actually came in a little bit bowed out and um, I actually had to put the top screw in and then come down here and put a clamp across the bottom in order to clamp in to get the bottom screw in, uh, which was frustrating, uh, especially while I was doing that, I was having to take the center wheels out of my Create Original frames which is a known issue. So uh, it, it took me a good little bit of effort to get these together. <laughs> so I'm hoping I like them. Now, um, apparently the material they used on the old plates is, has been changed for the new plates and they've put this uh, diamond logo on their new parts to signify that they're premium razor parts. I don't really know what that means yet. Uh, we're gonna see. Um, I'm probably not going to find out a whole lot today. Uh, I'm just going to skate some P-Rail in my garage. I just got off work, but I was just excited to get these together and talk about them a little bit. Um, I did actually have to... So this is an old SL2 all-white boot. I actually did have to change out the whole base plate as well. For some reason, the white base plates that were on these skates initially just refused to fit the new sliders on there. So um, I, I'm, I'm thankful that I did go ahead and order new base plates to match everything because I couldn't get the original ones to work with them. Uh, it, it is a, I, I'm not even gonna pretend that it was easy, it was annoying. Uh, I was frustrated taking my skates apart and putting them back together for 45 minutes to an hour and kept thinking, why isn't this easier? They should just slide in place like the old sliders. Um, and I might have just gotten uh, a batch that warped a little bit in shipping or in heat or something along those lines. Or it could be because I'm skating the 6.7 shell and it's a smaller plate, so it just fits tighter. I'm not really sure. I just wanted to warn you guys of that before you order these. You are gonna, well, I 100% had issue getting them on. Uh, other than that, they look good. Um, it Once you get them on there, it actually really reminds me of how the shift skate looks from the side with the, the, the one piece uh, sole frame that pops off this side and then a whole bottom plate that can be popped off easily to switch out. Um, it reminds me of that. It seems like a similar design. The backslide groove seems uh, nearly identical I don't think it's any deeper or any shallower. The plates maybe are a little bit bigger. It's hard to say because I've been skating these for a couple, for a month now or so. Um, so I could have worn the sides of them down some. Um, from the top, which I'm trying to show you guys the top, but from the top, I don't see a whole lot of difference. The new plate is a little sleeker kind of just swoops out 
rather than having this kind of like bump out that it had before with like a divot. I don't know if you guys can see that. I don't know if I'm close enough or not. But um, again, I didn't have any issues with the original plates. I just, uh, I've been riding the SLs for about five or six weeks now and I'm really enjoying the skates. And when they came out with new parts, how could I resist trying out the new parts? So uh, yeah, if you guys have any questions about anything I had to do to get these to fit, because it, it was pretty frustrating for me, um, go ahead and just ask away. Otherwise, I'm gonna skate my P-Rail with them for a little bit. Uh, like I said, I don't think I'm gonna notice any difference when it comes to sliding or locking on a P-Rail, but I wanna play around in them some, so I hope you guys enjoy. All right, guys, so just like I thought, I really didn't notice any noticeable differences in just skating a P-Rail with the, the new sliders. Um, I will say maybe they felt a little bit faster at first, but uh, once I did 10 or so grinds, they, they kind of started to feel the same. And I don't know if that was just because they're fresh and I got some wax on them, so they started to slow down a little bit. Um, but yeah, no real differences. Um, I, I literally can't... I, I don't personally know why it was so important to make it one piece. Um, I'm going to continue to skate it because I'm hoping to figure that out. Um, I think the biggest difference that's going to make a on anything is going to be maybe a ledge. So uh, maybe I'll try to skate a ledge in the next couple of days and give a proper review. Again, this is just kind of my first impressions of them. I do like the way they look. Um, and it's a much simpler design to not have to change out two separate sliders and a backslide plate. But at the same time, they were pretty tough to get on. So I'm kind of whatever. <laughs> I, I it, it honestly doesn't make a difference to me right this moment, but I'm gonna keep playing with them and maybe I'll start to see why it was so important to everyone for these to be one solid piece. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, let me know if you have any questions.